Hey everybody, Akira's here. Welcome back to the long dark. 500 days of interloper. Alright, so we are in Pleasant Valley. We're in the community hall area of the map. Now something. Let's take a peek outside here, see how the weather is. Let's go ahead and get a drink too. We have like five liters of water, so we're doing pretty good. Something I've been debating since I played the first episode was. Signal Hill. Now one of one of the things we have to get it's only negative eleven degrees. <laughs> Sounds pretty bad, but all in all, it's not too bad. I'm thinking warm up here completely, then maybe go to Signal Hill. And the reason is there's sometimes there's sometimes some pretty good stuff there. I don't expect great clothes because you're not going to find great clothes in Interloper, but I am. Hoping maybe there's a heavy hammer there. If there's a heavy hammer there, I really can't pass it up. So I think we have to go back and try for that because that is something that I need just for the very basics for the improvised knife and the improvised hatchet. So I think I'll sleep here for an hour, warm up, and hopefully the weather holds. We'll see how. How we're looking. Everything's looking good. Okay. The other thing is I might... Might run over to the community hall real quick. Uh, let's see if we can drop anything. Because we're right at the 30 kilograms. If we pick up that heavy hammer, we're going to have to drop some things. And we're going to probably be coming back through here to head to Mystery Lake anyway. So I'm thinking maybe we should drop some stuff here. And leave it behind. Like, I don't need this hat. I'm going to drop that. I don't need extra pair of mittens. Drop those. Let's organize by, by weight. Three pieces of fire firewood. A little much. We can get firwood anywhere. So I'll pick up... Uh, I'll leave... Uh, I'll grab one of those pieces of uh, cedar wood. Yeah, I'll keep that with me. But I uh, don't need all this right now all right let's see here I don't need I really don't need the fur wood at all so that should give us enough weight to carry the heavy hammer plus there's a, a rope to get up there and I want to have that as an option two tin cans are a little much don't need those right now sewing kits they're light I don't want to forget them or lose them and it has leather on it that might be worthwhile later but you know what let's go drop those let's drop this scarf some socks I'm not wearing at all I'll drop those like everything else I am wearing water's a little much but we're good now so let's go ahead and get going start heading that way that's negative 18 now so I got a little bit cooler oh well let's head back we'll check this little uh check out this little gas station real quick Might as well. Funny just watching that cold just disappear so quickly. Just for warming up. Be worthwhile in here. Uh, oh, we got this some can oats. be really useful. Okay. Trying to fill up my my inventory again after I just you know cleared it out, but I don't, I don't really want stump remover. Another potato. All right.
be nice to find a pry bar in here. That would be okay. That'll come so in here. We're disinfectant. We're bandaged. I'll take those. I don't remember these drawers. Like vegetable drawers. Huh. Like four potatoes? Jeez. Added a bit of bit of weight to me. Got one more car back here. Okay. All right, let's go. Gonna do wind sprints all the way there, I think. We got that wolf that was lurking over there. I'm assuming he's gonna still be in that general area. But uh, I think he sticks to the road in front of me, okay. Problem was I was cutting through that area. I skipped this truck. Because the wolf was on our tail, so I need to check this real quick. No heavy hammers here. Nothing at all. Well, the thing I'm that really sold me on Signal Hill was I'm like, eh, it's kind of risky, but we could be passing on some really important stuff that might drive us crazy a little bit later looking for that one item we got a decoy deer over there if needed but we also have a lot of bailout options if the weather goes bad you know we got the barn we got that uh, small barn in front of the red barn we got the homestead if need be so I think we got quite a few good options There's Signal Hill right there. Could cut across, but I'm going to stay on the road. I think visibility is a little bit better. Right now, I really don't want to get into a surprise attack situation. So cold. Yeah, I mean, this wasn't that bad, right? Literally, if we were being chased down, then things were getting too bad we could always head over there we shouldn't have a hypothermia or a frostbite risk just the hypothermia for right now so, our temperature negative 21 degrees so I was thinking well we could could head over there to warm up but I don't think it's gonna be that much warmer so, let's stick with what we got here No pry bar yet. Can't get into the, a lot of these containers. Okay, there we go. Nothing there. And nothing there. Yep, there you are. Center of the screen. Got some more deer over here, that's a good sign. The right. I always have the feeling Signal Hill should be like right here, but it's not. So he's further down. You see it from a distance, it looks a lot closer, but it actually is. Got some crows here. I believe there's an outbuilding here that we can check out. Check out this outbuilding. Here's the dilapidated shed. Maybe 
you, MC Hammer. No, you're not. You're worthless. Excellent. You got some dog food. At least I'm not the only dog food on the map. Alright, let's keep going. So, I'm thinking... I'm thinking I'm just going to go straight up over this hill. Might as well take the heads as well. Drop the first ones, but I can go pick them up. Okay, let's go. A couple hundred calories there. Got a rabbit there, that's good. I don't like that. Alright, let's watch out for the bear. Sometimes there's a bear out this this general area. My mic's a little close, keep bumping it with my chin. Coming at it from a different angle than I normally do. That's alright. our rope. Not gonna waste my energy running up to it. It's an alternate path, but you know what happens when you go up those paths? Snap, crackle, pop, right? At least for me. Alright, let's uh, give ourselves a little boost up here. Hopefully this was worth it. I just want to say thank you guys for the uh, really, really warm welcome back in the comments of the first episode. Meant a lot. I read like all of them. There was a lot. So, it really. Episode really blew the numbers out of the water, so I really want to thank you for that. Lots of likes, lots of comments. Really appreciate it, guys. Oh, ptarmigans! Look at that. Can I, can I get them? Now, here's a question. I probably should be screwing with these, but can I get them with a rock? We'll never know. <laughs> yeah, they flew away. That's okay. I wonder if they'll land somewhere close by. All right, grab my rock. I don't know. Can you guys actually hit them with rocks? It seems like you should be able to. That one's still flying. It was heading that way. So they kind of split up a little bit. Yeah, he's still up there. It's right there. I think he's... Better pay attention to where I'm going. Walk straight into the jaws of... A hungry... Predator. This looks new. Is this one of these things that you can... Dig up, or is this old? No, that's been there. That's old. I was looking at this. I thought maybe it was one of that that, root, that new root plant that they have. Well, this would be the place to do the uh, old survey if I wanted to. Right now, I just want to get inside. All right. Well, we made it to Signal Hill. This will always be good to have. In case we need to make a tea. Painkiller tea. Might be useful in a recipe too, I don't know. Alright, let's head inside. More wires. Thank you for the uh, advice about the wires or the, the heads up about the wires. Fuses, wires, repairs, control towers. During Aurora, so you can get information from it. So, look for that. Five degrees. I think the risk of getting up there, but it's gonna start checking around here. Let's see what we can find. I could go for some painkillers. Uh, not a car battery. A flare would be nice. It's a good defensive device. I don't think I had one of those yet, so. What do we got here? What's this? Replacement fuse. Not what I was looking for. More wires. 
Pinnacle peaches. I think those are always there. Toaster. No clothes so far. I think can't open it. That'll be good. Save some calories. I have to bust them up. I think we'll put on the running shoes. I think they're better. The knees. They gotta be right. Yeah, they're much better. Right. Um, these are a bit beefy. I'm gonna go ahead and drop these. I can get leather, you know, a lot of places, so I'm not too worried about that. I think a lot of the good stuff's been replaced by these replacement fuses. I don't know how many of those you need, but I'm gonna pick up a few of them. Unless they're like half a kilogram each, then I'll probably only carry one or two. Because they seem to be literally I can make heavy early. With this. They're pretty light. But I probably have a kilo, uh, kilogram of those already, so no more. Are these lighter? Yeah. Hope nobody needs this anymore. Coffee. I got a couple of cans of coffee. I really don't use coffee as much as I probably should. I should make some more coffee. Six, good. I'm warming up at least. Don't really think about that, man. Uh, well, at least I know that'd be a crazy spot to put something. At least I know I didn't miss anything here. I guess I could tear up this cardboard box. How long will it take? It'll take 27 minutes. Holy smokes! You could literally. I should be able to just move this thing. Well, we need to wake. We need to warm up anyway, so. Do that, see if it opens up anything. Nope. Give me some tinder. Something's making me feel tired. Yeah, it would probably be, you know, fatigue. Oh, oh well. What's up here? Newspapers? That's nothing. I'll let me grab it. Alright, well. I really want to know what's in this one, but we're not going to find out, so. Alright, well, I think... I think we sit here and warm up for just a little bit, then we head on back down to the to the town. So, let's rest up here a little bit. I need a drink. Let me see here. Probably wouldn't hurt. There we go. Alright. Good deal. I might eat something though. I might just do that. What do we want to eat? Some dog food? Sure. Delicious dog food. What else? Ketchup chips. Make us thirsty, but I'm just thinking I'd like to replenish a little bit more of my health. Just in case we get into a fight. Uh, I'm going to drop those. I'm not going to eat those. So. Uh, those are kind of sketchy too. I'll probably drop both of those. Let's go to eat these. 86%. There we go. Let's get another drink. I guess we got... Oh, I forgot. You actually get hydrated from the sar sardines, which is pretty gross, but... It. Let's go by condition. See what we can ditch. Those are going to be okay. Peach is probably not. Someone said it'll be fine. Those will be fine. Potatoes, I'm not sure. If you use them in a recipe, I don't know if they sort of rejuvenate themselves. Those are scary. Those are scary. Everything else probably going to be okay. We're carrying 12. Wow. 12 kilograms of food. Alright. Let's go ahead and grab some sleep here. We are starting to get a little tired. Just grab an hour. We'll probably sleep again at the uh, community hall. But I'd like to make it back there if possible. Weather allows us. Let's take a peek outside and see what it looks like. It's not too bad. Negative nine is uh, not as bad as what we've had to deal with before. 
so let's go ahead and make the most of this. I'm just going to kind of walk it because I don't want to wear myself out too, too much. I think I missed my turn. Yeah. That's okay. Just take the long road. Save a little bit of energy. I know going down isn't nearly as bad, but just go this way. Yeah, should be over there. Pretty happy as long as I don't have the... Uh, Deep incline warning happening. Here we go. I kind of went the long way, didn't I? Is this where... This is where you just gather brush, yeah. I didn't think that was the... Uh, that root vegetable. I can't, can't remember the name of it now. That's alright. Peek for the bear. Looks okay. Too encumbered? What are you talking about? I'm encumbered? Oh, because I'm tired. I have any type of energy drink or anything? Oh well. Let's just let's just walk around. No big deal. We can walk it. into the wind a little bit. We should be able to should be walking with the wind once we get down. Yeah, it's my fatigue. That's what's hurting me. I'm not sure why I feel so tired. I'm just going to stop and pause every so often. Not sure if that helps or not. I was standing still. I was standing still. How's that even happen? With my wrist. That was ridiculous. Can't feel my hands. Yeah, well. That's good. Apparently, you sprained your wrist. All right, we're just going to go for the uh, homestead. We're not going to stop at that cave. Jeez. I've never felt so cold in my life. That's kind of annoying. Oh well. I would like to, uh... Would have liked to make it back to the community hall, but unforeseen circumstances. Oh well, at least we have this right here. Oh, well, we can check the mailbox this time at least. Heavy hammer? Nope. I don't want to get too, uh, too tired, because I'd have to use an emergency stim at that point. I just want to make sure I know where it's at. There we go. Because if I get completely fatigued, I can't run at all, which probably wouldn't be a good, good thing. But it looks like the coast is clear. But I still don't want to rely on that. Alright, we'll just come here, sleep the night away, do some crafting, maybe some repair or something like that. And, uh, crush up some herbal tea, maybe make a couple of cups of coffee, that sort of stuff. 
yeah, I don't think it would have been smart to continue on the community hall. With a sprained wrist and a, uh, basically not being able to run at all. Alright, here we go. Okay, we made it back. Alright, kind of full circle there. But, uh... I wonder if I can... Can I do a repair when I have a sprained wrist? I wonder if it'll let me even tear up, uh... Got some cloth there, but... I wonder if it'll let me do this. It does, with a sprained wrist, which I'm kind of surprised about. That's okay. I didn't get, uh... Thermic there. Just to I think this is we're still getting rid of the one where uh this is the one from where I was going up the single hill, I think. Alright, let's go ahead and try doing some repairs if we can. I always forget whether I can do that or not. Uh does anything need repaired? These wool socks for sure. We don't want to mess about those. It does, it lets you do that. That's good. It lets you fail at least. I'd lay down right here if I thought I'd ever wake up again. You're about to lay down right here. So this is 96 percenters now. That's good. Take a look at what else? 83. Everything else looks pretty good. Pretty happy with all that. Let's go ahead and um, I need take a look at right my now. recipes. If I have. I got enough for some porridge. So that might be good to have. 10, 20 minutes. We could try making that. That'd be kind of fun. Recycle can recipes. Oh. Okay, so I do need to have at least one recycle can on. Okay, no big deal. We'll find more because I'm about to probably create some recycled cans here, but uh, I think what we'll do here is probably do the rose hips. So I have some rosehip tea, since I can't find painkillers. So, where are they at? There they are. The, uh, yeah, where the, it's down here. Paired rosehips. You just do one? Takes 24, exactly, okay. Get a little fire going. Should be able to cook up tea, I believe. Let's give it a try. See what happens. First fire of the series is a failure. crafting. Oh, fire hardened. Is it, all I need is a stick. I don't even need to make it into a shaft. It's just a stick. That's cool. And some crow feathers. Alright. That's not too bad. I don't have a tool. Yet. So I need. I will need a knife. Improvised hatchet or improvised knife will count. Will work. Hatchet and regular knife. Not available, so. Okay. That's cool. See here. Rose hip high. All right. Now let's use the cooking pot. I have a recycled can, but I guess I don't have a recipe for it. Um, how long will that take? It'll take 44. Don't need that much. Think here. Let me think. Water, not water. Let's do cook. There we go. Prepared rose hips. That's what I was trying to do. So we got a rose hip tea. That's good. And then maybe we'll do a uh, coffee. 
to the coffee. Forty-seven minutes. Do like two of those. Fumble our way upstairs. This might, this might take a minute. Straight through here. To the, okay, I think these are the stairs. Sound like stairs. Okay, now I'll make a go straight this way for a little bit. Turn this way. Luckily, I know my way around house a little bit straight back should have the yeah yep yeah, that's the that's the bedroom I could eat a horse and the bed should be right there <laughs> I can't believe I found it all right let's go ahead and drink something here let's figure out what we want to have to eat yeah we're gonna need to eat something let's do some tomato soup for giggles. Doesn't sound too off-putting. And some dog food, I guess. Really should have ate the dog food first. The nasty taste in my mouth. I think we should have enough calories now. Yeah, we got a thousand calories. We're fine for the, for the night. Make it through the night. And we're plenty hydrated. Okay, good. Let's go ahead and sleep for like ten. See you guys in the morning. Now our uh, wrist will be completely healed, so that'll be good. Is it morning? Should be close. Yeah, it's pretty close. Let's fumble our way downstairs. It's still pretty dark. I really need a lantern, don't I? I could eat Jeez. anything. Well, it's not the downstairs. Get downstairs. There we go. I got caught on something. Be downstairs. I'm just gonna have to rest here until I can get some daylight. I think that's what's gonna happen. Okay. Get a drink first. Nice to be almost almost healed up. I'm gonna try to stay keep a little bit of food on board just to you know keep from getting too too far down here with the, uh, the health meter. Got that. Uh, what do we have for calories? 319? That ain't gonna last very long. Let's see what we want to eat. Some of these chips. I could have prepared some of these potatoes. That might not be the worst thing. Seems that they seem to be pretty plentiful. But I guess these vegetables, you know, they don't respawn or anything, so. There's that. I could make a uh, oatmeal. That'd be kind of interesting. I might do that. So I'll eat some of these, but then I don't want to make an oatmeal. I just want to see what happens there. Because it said, with the oatmeal, it said, uh, the porridge. Yeah. It said 20 to 75%. That's, oh, that's, is that the condition? What is that? Do you gain that much condition from it? Or is it just an estimate of what it'll be based on my cooking skill? Huh. Not sure. Oh well, we'll figure it out. Let's sleep until the sun comes up a little bit more. So I don't stub my toe. Okay, there we go. Much better. Alright, so yeah, I was basically fumbling my way through here. Trying to get to here to go downstairs. Alright, drink some more water. And then, uh... Hey guys, you guys want to make some porridge? I say we make some porridge. It sounds kind of good. Let's live a little bit. Um, do I really want to use... I could bust this thing up. To reclaim wood. Yeah, we got we got wood. We'll find more wood along the way. It's not a big deal. So let's just use what we got here. With the uh, cedar wood. Should be plenty. My only concern is matches, but... I never... I always seem to be swimming in Come matches. 
by the first week. By the end of the first week. Alright, there we go. Let's see here. Place the cooking pot up here. Okay. Cook. Porridge. Need to eat soon. It's going to use a little bit of water, I assume. Yeah, okay. How long is it? 20 minutes to cook? I bet you it warms you up, too. You eat it straight away. Let's, let's eat it. Wait. Heck, what? Oh, I'm actually cooking it now. It's past time till it's ready. Let's take it. Uh, we do one more. Even if it's cold, it'll still be pretty good, right? So let's do that. I like it. Like Master Chef. 19 minutes, 16 until ready. Perfect. Let's pick up that scalding hot pot. Let's eat some of this hot porridge. Before we head out, should warm our soul. Oh, it's not hot. It's not. Oh, it is considered hot. Okay, good. I thought it gave an indicator over here. Yeah, both hot. All right, let's go ahead and eat this. Three hundred fifty calories. Nice. I think I'm just going to eat both of these. Yeah. All right, there we go. All right, let's head on out. Back to community hall. Negative 27 degrees. We needed that. I'm not going to cut across. Because I ran into that wolf last time. So I'm just going to stick to the road. I think we have any afflictions. Yeah, just warming up bonus. So. Definitely a good thing. I can't believe I'm getting tired so quick. I'm like already a quarter of the way tired. I just like woke up and made some porridge. Kind of weird. Hey, rabbit. I would kill you and make mittens out of you, but... I don't think I can skin you right now. I think I'd just be stuck with your carcass as a uh, wolf bait. Off we go. Wind sprints again. I did check this card, didn't I? Yeah, pretty sure I did. Just didn't put the hood up. Maybe I didn't, because it just said that I discovered Harper Reed. I think I cut across. No. Okay. Wolf's howling back in that direction. So should be safe from that one at least. What do you mean? Really? I just ate two bowls of porridge. I mean, compared to my normal survivors, this, this version of Will, Will version 16 or whatever this is, he's been kind of spoiled on the food. Been a bit, bit gluttonous so far. I think the reason why my... Uh, health has been down. I've always had something in the red, or two things in the red if it was cold, so. There was that. Alright, I'm ready to get out of PV. Ready to head over to Mystery Lake. Loot, loot, loot there. Head on over to Forlorn. Hopefully by then we have a hammer. I know I'd check this one. Alright, I'm checking because I... Yeah, visors are down. Can I see that from the outside? Yeah, you can. Okay. Way back there. Peeled. 
This is where we got our friend last time. Fingers feel numb. This general area. I think he's right about... Yeah, it was when we left the bar and I cut straight across. I found him right over in this area here. But I don't want to get tunnel vision either. Move up here. There, there he is. Yep. I'm going to cut wide here. There we go. Yeah. He's guarding his kill. Oh no, that's a that's a deer. I was tripping out there for a second. It's a deer in morning. Alright, I see some rooftops over there. We'll uh warm up there, continue on, try to make it through to ravine, hopefully to Pleasant Valley. Oh, or not Pleasant Valley, what am I talking about? Mystery Lake. Carter Hydra Dam. I'd like to end. I'd like to. I think that'd be a good uh, goal or finishing spot for this episode if we can make it to the Hydra Dam. I'm gonna check this truck bed real good, man. I feel like there should be something good in this. There never is. That'd be such a good place to have something. Or next to it, like you know, got tossed out like a barrel. Oh well. Let's go up here. It's still not even noon yet, and I'm already, like, getting a little tired. I'm gonna go inside this nice warm house here. Nice warm bed. Sleep for about four hours. Maybe about three. Probably three. Yeah. Let's go back up here to our house. Alright. I'm gonna check the, this whole... I don't think I checked the back of this house. Nope. All right, let's get inside. Ah, oh, man. Well, Signal Hill didn't really give us the results I'd hoped for, but, you know, at least we tried. How are we doing on calories? 734, that'd, that'd be fine. Uh, let's do four hours. Let's, yeah, let's do, f let me take a look. Let's do four. It's like a half of a solid night's sleep. Our thirst probably worth a drink, but I think we would be we would have been just fine. All right, open for not horrible weather. Be good. Yeah, we're pretty well rested up now, so not to run or anything like that. It's not going to be I a need to find food. big danger. You're good, you're good. Don't worry about that. Alright, let's get out of here. Right. This can get a little tricky. Take a peek over here. I can't... I don't know if you can normally see the wolf on it. Is that... Yeah, building might actually be... enterable. I think normally it's burned down. I play through. We'll double check. It might be boarded up. At least there's a car out front. We can get in sort of like a Cujo situation. There's a wolf. And a couple buildings. Boarded up and boarded up. A couple vehicles. Check them here real quick. Card? Nope. Foreclosed. There's another vehicle. I was like, wasn't there another vehicle over here? Just got kind of disappeared back here. Something on the floorboard. <laughs> I'm leaving it. I don't need any more replacement fuses at the moment. They're everywhere. All right, let's get going.
All right, we do have a flare, at least. Could bust that out. I really don't want to have to fight a wolf at this point, so flares are definitely welcome in my inventory. And surprisingly, I think I only have the one. Yeah, I only have the one. That direction, kind of. Look at us. We're actually healing up. It's nice. general direction we might have to run into that one pardon me that will we might have to deal with that one but hopefully we can just sort of kite it not worry about it too much oh the weather's changing but that's okay we're gonna be in a cave caves are normally really good for weather protection so glad we didn't sleep five hours otherwise we'd be waiting this storm out i see a rabbit here so I guess the worst comes to worst. There's normally a wolf that likes to walk right along this path. Mining road. So let's see if we can time it. Cold is making right. my head feel thick. Yeah, I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna mess around with it too much. Oh yeah, he's right in front of me. Wonderful. I wonder if I can bring. I'm gonna bring him back by the rabbit. Too cold to think. We're gonna we're gonna use this little bunny here. He should divert. I could eat anything right now. We should hear the bunny squeal. There it is. The bunny just got killed. I don't know if you guys can hear it. It was very faint. But he should be eating that bunny right now. Thank you, little guy. There he is, right in the middle of the screen, eating the bunny. Okay, time to go. Before he finishes his meal. Besides, he wants seconds. Okay, there we go. I can see the sign for the, the mining cave. It's just up on the hill. It's a little hard to see, but it'll appear behind these trees here in a second. Just saw it a second ago. Okay. There's that sign I was telling you about. Okay, let's get up here. Weather be getting nasty. Once you make it this far, normally you're pretty good. I don't. I've never really run into an issue at this point, so should be pretty safe traveling from this point forward. All that health that we regenerated walking around today well fed we're getting it sapped away right now try to stay right in the middle of this road it seems like no sprain risk if you do that or if walk at this angle maybe i don't know we're gonna get it again right here though i don't think we can do much about that yeah not much we can do i would stop but Stop and take it slow, but that doesn't seem to help. Alright, we have plenty of antiseptic, so I'm not too worried about Olin's beard right now. Let's get inside this cave, shall we? 
to wait out the storm. I don't know if we'll make it. I don't know if we'll make it to Hydra Dam or not, but... Maybe we'll get lucky inside of here, you never know. I mean, I'm gonna have to use the flare just to see. Which kind of sucks. I'm so hungry. Alright. Well, hopefully. Let's see how dark it gets. We'll see. I know it's probably very dark for you guys, I apologize. I don't want to use the flare. If I had any other way to light this up for you guys, I would. But I can see just fine right now, so. Hopefully we can find some more flares. Uh, there's a piece of coal. We'll need that for when we start. Oop. No, 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 no. Don't do that. Need that for the forge. Normally the forge has some coal right next to it, though. But I don't want to necessarily rely on that, you know? Could end up being useful. Uh, I don't need those. I'm going to leave those behind. Uh, all right. Go up this way, double back, but I don't think there's anything up here. Well, maybe a piece of coal. Okay. Yeah, we're right back where we started. Okay. Alright, take the circular staircase down. I think there's a dead guy or a fire or something back here in there. No, not today. Must be thinking of something different. Alright, let's head this way first. It's just a dead end, but sometimes there's a pry bar or something worthwhile. Frozen corpse. Next to the bag. Head back up a little bit here. Take this other tunnel down this way. What's our temperature here? Feels like 9 degrees. I mean, it's warmer than the house. So, the homestead. So that's pretty good, right? Yeah, come on, give me a pry bar or something. Huh? Give me some. A pry bar would be nice because I could use it as a weapon as well. So, get access to a lot of these extra locations that I. That I think I'm leaving behind some pretty decent loot, unfortunately. But if you do. Just grab that up. Let's take that. Search his backpack. Nothing. Anything on the workbench? Fishing line? Nothing. Nope. Locked. Okay. How's our health doing? 1% hypothermia. Hey, we're hungry. I might as well eat. Let's see here. Let's have a can of these sardines right here. Just a little hydration as well. A piece of coal. Take that. Coal does regenerate. But it needs to be picked up first. So you can pick it up and then leave it at the entrance and it'll regenerate. And then you can just have like a little coal supply, an ongoing coal supply if you want. Just keep harvesting it, but it at the entrance do that. I'm not sure how often it regenerates. I've never really cared that much. Eh, that's going to be the exit, but let's go check down here and check this little place. Make sure this guy doesn't have a AK-47. Nope, no AKs. Bet you if I wasn't playing Interloper, he would. I'm just collecting all this coal and seeing if I'm going to end up... I saw one here. Was it? I just bounced over. Oh, it's a stone. Right about now. Never mind. Uh, well, let's see. Anything in here? Maybe a pry bar? Today? First aid kit. Painkillers would be good. Antibiotics would be good too. See anything back there? I don't see anything back there. I don't know if you guys have your brightness turned up to the max or not, but 
I don't. I just can't see anything back there. Uh, let's check this little... That's the exit. I think I see daylight shining around there. Nope. Okay. Let's check up here. I think this does a circle. Yeah. Just does a circle right there. Okay. This should be the exit. I think I just saw a sliver of daylight right there. There it is. Finally. Thank you for your patience, everybody. But, like I said, didn't want to use up my one and only flare. I think I got another flare, actually. What is this? Oh, that's a stem. Really tiny flare. Kind of look like. Uh, nothing there. Let's see much. Sewing kit. Bunch of coal. Should be overweight by now. Jeez. Can't believe I'm carrying around all this coal. Like, just fine, too. Huh, what's my weight at? It's gotta be close to max. It is, but... Alright, well... Let's take a peek outside see what the weather looks like. Might have to stay here for a minute. Oh, shh. Uh, not my favorite place to pop out at, but... Weather don't look too bad. All right, let's go for it. Fatigue ain't too bad. Gotta make our way over. Part of me wants to check the uh, forestry lookout, but sometimes there's a wolf here. It becomes annoying. Oh, we made it. Okay. Well, if the blizzard kicks up, we got options. We got sleeping options here. There's a little trailer down here. Should be nice and cozy for us. Starting to get a bit late. Part of me wants to kind of explore this area too before we move on. Let me know in the comments. Should I stick around coastal and explore this area first? Or should I just beeline it for Mystery Lake? I'm leaning towards exploring coastal. Sure, not too hateful. To find some place to escape this cold. Occasionally, you'll find something stacked behind these trailers. Unfortunately, it's normally a rifle. If you do get lucky and find something back there, obviously that's not going to help us. And that not happen. What's up here? Oh, I thought that was like a peacoat jacket. Uh. Not a chance, though. Not an interloper. I don't. I don't imagine. I'm not sure we're gonna stumble into anything that nice. What have we here? I don't know, but I'm pretty sure we can layer that up, which we can for a minuscule. We're gonna go ahead and repair that, though. All right. Not worried about my getting that. Uh, carry bonus. Well fed bonus. I'm not worried about that right now. I do want to save a little bit of food. Just in case. Because right now I can't harvest my own food. Like uh, hunting or anything like that. So I probably do fishing. But I need to need to get tackled. And things like that first. Alright. My stomach feels like an empty pit. Well I don't really want to spend too much time here. See, see what the weather's doing. Looks pretty... Getting kind of thirsty. Pretty crappy. Not really too keen on heading out from here right now. Let me think this out. Think this through here. Let me take a quick look here. Yeah, I'm not too keen on going into this because this could turn into a blizzard halfway Can't down the hill. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to see my threats. Too worried about... I'll, I'll stumble my way into shelter, no problem, but I don't want to stumble my way into... You know... Wolf or bear. So I think I'm going to hole up here. And this looks like a good time to stop anyway. So, uh, yeah. Thank you guys, again, for all the support. Really appreciate it. If you want to become a producer on the, on the channel, have your name up in lights as a producer for as little as $1 per month. 
head on over to patreon.com forward slash Acurage2. And uh, make sure you hit that like. Uh, leave me a good comment about what I should do next. I'll see you in the next one. Y'all take care.